Well, the community corrections facility in Delano opened today, and for an area with a 27% unemployment rate, this move could mean a lot for the local economy. 23 ABC's Chris Ornelas is live in Delano now with a look at the new facility. Chris? Well, Jackie, that first batch of 84 inmates is now inside the facility, and they are the first inmates inside the Delano CCF in more than two years. Now, Democratic Assembly member Rudy Salas was here today to commemorate the reopening of the CCF. He says it will make the community safer and Delano's economy stronger. Officials here say there will be about 230 inmates here by the end of the week, and within a month, they expect the facility to be at its 578 inmate capacity. Salas says it will make state prisons safer by reducing overcrowding, and it's better than simply releasing the inmates to the streets. Rather than putting prisoners back out into the community and out into, into our local streets, what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that we're housing them here. Now, this reopening is expected to bring about 100 jobs to the local economy. Now, coming up at 6, we'll speak to one of the correctional officers who worked here before and is now returning to her job. Reporting live in Delano, Chris Ornelas, 23 ABC.